And welcome back. This is Kotel for round two. South Divided Campaign. We have a downtown match. And this is 19th Indiana fighting the undefeated HL uh, to the east of Petersburg, supported by CSAB, a community token. And I have a guest with me, Mr. Lightburn from the Fourth West Virginia. Hello, Colonel Lightburn from Fourth West Virginia. Nice to see everybody again. Yeah, and since we are live right away, we will not have any time for any intros. We got action already. Here comes 19th Indiana down the road. I don't even know if they did loads. I think this is a straight just charge. You got 4th, 4th US and 83rd with him as well. Oh, wait a second. Oh, Hood's coming over the hill too. He's coming down the stairs. <laughs> Hold the line, HL. Oh my God! Throw left, throw left, throw left. Yeah, forget about intros. We don't have no time for that. There's no time, sir. There is no time. Oh my gosh! The wrong line. And here comes the TSA again. Just from spawn, they didn't even get loads. They're not even getting loads. They're just getting bayos and going. No, it's it 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 is a big melee. What do you think of this current strategy? I like it. Um, hit the Union early and claim point early and basically once you've got the Union wiped, uh, basically spawn trap them. I mean, really, once you have the stairs, it, it's it's over for the Union. And, and that has been achieved within the first not even two minutes. Yeah, that was very quick. Uh, about a minute and a half and CSA's going to be able to claim point here within the next, I would say, minute or so. It's just a constant stream coming down from uh, Maine. They're not even loading. They're just getting payos and going. I'm going to have to zoom out a little bit, actually. There's too many bodies. My, my processor can't handle this. Yeah. That's kind of why I'm just hovering above the fight. I mean, Union's still holding. Um, it looks like they recovered a little bit. They, they were able to yeah, recover. They, yeah, they've recovered the stairs, but here comes Hood again. Uh, looks like he's going for that top, uh, that hill flank again, coming down the stairs. Now, if I'm Union, I'm watching for that now. And they're not. Hood's going to be able or dancing this time. It's actually dancing in 123rd. Now, I would say you're putting yourself at a disadvantage here uh, by not getting loads. Because uh, Union was able to shoot you down. Maybe yeah. that's why Union was able to hold. Yeah, I think I think that was a big part of it. Um, I mean, they are about even on tickets, though. Maybe Union's slightly ahead? Uh, Union has a slight ticket advantage, but it's not much. It may be 5%. Here we go again. 42nd going to slam into this line. Uh, I don't know if it'll be enough, though. Union is laying down perfect fire. Here you have uh, Wombat and uh, or no Knight. Knight in ten Tennessee was a nice little uh, maneuver there on the side to form kind of an L four formation here. It definitely did some damage. CSA plan was to go brute force here and just force a melee. Yeah, they might also be going for casualties. Um, Folks is now the key. Very damaged. Yeah. Yes. Um, now the key here for Union is to keep getting those re reinforcements in. You have to have a constant stream coming in. Because uh, if you do not, CSA is going to break through. It's getting thin, but it hasn't fallen yet. I see Corporal Burt there. But, uh, got a bit of a break here, a little bit. Uh, I don't think we'll have any breaks now that I'm looking at this map here. Uh, what, what can you tell us about Corporal Burt? Don't let them get their flags, boys. Um, so, Corporal Burt, uh, I always you refer to him as Ben. Uh, I just feel weird saying Burt. Um, he's a, he's a newer, um, he's a newer officer. He's been an NCO with us for a few months now. So, he's not new to the regiment. Uh, he's one of our older standing members, um, and he's 
he's been uh, taking in a lot of information. Because um, I've been playing the game since the early alpha days. So, for me, I'm passing that knowledge on to my guys. Um, so that I can do things like this and take small breaks. And, um, yeah, he's, he's a newer officer. I think this is only his second. Yeah, this is his second time leading, so... This is the hell of a we'll see how to be, it goes. Uh, leading for your second time here. Yeah, uh, I told him, I said, it's going to be a slugfest. It's probably going to be a bloodbath. And, uh, gave him some words of encouragement and uh, wished him luck. And we'll see how he does. So far, zooming out here, looks like the Union is holding for now. And I think they've taken a bit of a ticket lead here. Yeah, they're taking about 25% uh, advantage right now. They haven't really lost any I ground don't... yet, either. I think you're right about this, though. Um, I think you're right about the fact that I think the CSA is just trying to deal casualties and not win right now, because they've already got a win tonight. I think this is all about casualties and trying to uh, wipe Wilkes off the board. Yeah, there's some you know, peculiarities of you know the game board. Sometimes you have to... Why, why are they doing things that don't make as much sense? But this will produce a ton okay, of casualties. Okay, here we go. Now Hood is rushed, like he was acting like he was going down the alleyway between the houses, and he direct immediately turned into the uh, Union line. This might be enough right here to get through. I don't know. Got some reinforcements flooding in here. Here comes Jeff and Who is it? You still, you still have IVB uh, and PB holding the stairs still. Union is really catching up, getting ahead on tickets though. Oh yeah, that that gap's gonna uh, it's gonna keep increasing at this point. But I think uh, I think we're good. I think Union's gonna be able to continue to hold this. Mass charge that the uh, CSA is trying to throw at him. Here's the main point, though. Parker is now going to try that uh, that flank from up top coming down the stairs. See if oh, yep. IV is. is ready for him this time. Oh, he didn't go down the. Uh, he he jumped the uh, wall there. All right, IVB was ready for it this time, and they're able to just annihilate Parker. Looks like Danson came in with them too, but they got wiped as well. Here we are. Well, here we, we go. are at 37 minutes and we are taking losses. Eight minutes into the you know match. What? This might bring back my PTSD of that roulette lane that only lasted 15 minutes. <laughs> we might beat that. Oh, sorry. I think I'm that one added at 31 minutes. I'll have to look at the video again. I think that added, ended at 31 minutes. Yeah, I think this is a casualty farm right here for, for uh, CSA. I think that's all they're trying to do. They're trying to deal damage to uh, HL's token here. And with me, um, you know, Wilkes is my teammate, so if we lose Wilkes, uh, we're probably going to lose the fight in Virginia. No, his to keeping his token alive is very important, I think, right now. That token can get knocked out. He, the Union has a pretty good advantage. they got several fresh tokens in the field in Virginia that they can kind of flood in if they, uh, the CSA can't kind of hold that Southern Virginia line, so... And yeah, this is, uh, you know, there's only been six weeks, and Wilkes' token has been in five of the battles, so. Yeah, it looks like, uh, looks like he's going to be 5-0. and oh. Now we have a major push coming down the stairs. Looks like an entire team push from Maine. No, I haven't Does talked about it much, it, but a, a thing that the Union has done is they flooded everybody onto the two bottom regiments, which gives everybody bucket ball. 
Yep, they've gone ahead and stacked Buck and Ball. Which I think is a very wise decision, given uh, how close Spawn is. Oh yeah, and how close quarters the map is. I mean, you have to get in, you have to get in their face on this map. There we go. Much like Nico, you have to get in melees in order to win this map. So Union has done a good job, though. No, they're, they're holding it, and I think the buck and ball is a big piece of that, but they've also done a pretty good job of holding their line here. Oh, this might be a problem. That already shot came out just as 19th Indiana was coming in. Yeah, that was well-timed and well-placed. But Union has to keep that constant stream coming in. They yeah, that's, that's a bad thing about the bucket ball is they got to spawn main. It still takes a few seconds to get up. So if the CSA gets it, I don't I don't think they'll be able to retake it. But CSA is very close to breaking now. Union taking losses. This is crazy. I mean, this, this is exactly the opposite of what we saw last round. Uh, Union mutually supporting now. Yeah, I mean, it's a much smaller, uh, you know, amount of terrain. They've done good, again. they're reacting as a team. More so than they did last match. Yeah, no, absolutely. Now CSA wants to halt the attack now. Nice job, officer. Good job. Yeah, you too. Oh, another one. I got two. Oh, I get three. Oh, I got to kill three officers. Sweet. Nice. It looks like the CSA is holding it down here. I think they might be trying to figure out a, a big push angle. Um, yeah. Um, I was just listening to uh, Corporal Burt down there. I think that what he's saying I agree with. Um, CSA is massing for a, for a charge here. Uh, it looks like they're going to try stairs again. They've had the most success with that. So. Yeah, I think, I think the stair, that gap again. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. But I think the stairs. Is a, I, I heard that already shot. I missed it, though. Yeah, it, it obliterated the entire uh, Union line trying to plug the gap there on point. Now they're filling it back in again. CSA has hit breaking. Yep, but Union is just a, a hair away from breaking themselves. Pull the flags back a little bit. Flags, get the fuck back. Get this guy. Get get these guys. Get these guys. Destroy the rebels. Mm. Kill them all, boys. Union is able to get hold that again. Get a bayonet on and get in there. Now they need to get in there and clear their stairs off now. I um, mean, you've got. You can't allow them to recruit. Here we go. Yep, the counterattack from Union. Exactly what they needed to do here. I will say that CSA hasn't really halted on the stairs at all. They've they've cleared the stairs, but they haven't exactly taken them yet. No, we still got a few leftovers here coming in. Oh, for fuck's sake! Come here. But now you're giving USA, you're giving the Union a, a chance to load their bucking ball right now. Uh, when you're not coming in like you were. You're absolutely right about that. These pauses really do help the uh, Union. I think more than the CSA. I think if you're just going to continue to deal damage, you should just keep coming in. Keep flooding them. Because once you allow them to reload and get buck and ball, it, it, it's going to do exactly what it what we've been seeing the entire time. Uh, Union's going to hold a countless number of charges. They are very close to breaking now. I think this next charge will definitely do it. A CSA close, but... Um... It's at least going to take one or two more charges from the CSA to go to last or a final push. Yeah, so. I, th I, think, I think at least two. It won't be on one. Oh, 
depends on if the Union's able to farm some uh, out-of-line casualties Yeah, I'm here. watching these guys fighting with, you know, 42nd against this wall. It's just stupid. Just giving them five tickets. Giving them five tickets. Oh. No. Oh, no. Yeah, of course, the Artie's there, hitting them, too. You know, but the Artie, you can't really do much about. The out-of-line tickets, you can. Here they come. I can hear you, you rebel. Don't flinch, boys. Oh. All gas, no brakes. Now yeah. it looks like we're going for a forward deployment here. Everybody's going to basically guard the stairs now. And you've got a few watching the uh, the main road. And here comes the push from 42nd on the Union right. I'll be very interested to see the casualties after this uh, battle here. Looks like that 40 seconds of diversion. Here comes the main hit. Oh, yep. Down the stairs again. Now, if you're the Union watching this right side, you've got to turn this line now. You have nothing to shoot at. And all the fighting's behind you. I see a lot of guys reloading that should be in this melee. Okay, here comes the counter charge from uh, yeah, it looks like HL's going in. That's hard to tell. Yep, it's a HL and HD. That already did some damage right there. Thomas behind you. Alright. I think with this next uh, CSA push, uh, we should see final push. Uh yeah, this is it. They're they're, they're down to one more charge, just final push time. Union is at breaking, but they got a decent amount left. Maybe two thirds of a ticket of a morale state. They could get two more charges in, though. They could get one more to get the final push, and then they'll get one more to try and take point. Uh, I mean, yeah, they'll hit final push as they're going in, so. Oh, in the street, in the street, in the street. Right now, Union has to reset. They're kind of strung out right now. Artie's not doing him any favors with that either. No, Artie can definitely discombobulate you a bit. I'll block this fucking area. Go. Number you, number you good over here as long as you're over here. Red brick building, boys. Red brick building. This has been a pretty good hold here from the Union. Oh, they've, they've, now, they've kept it, yeah. Union's going to overweight the stairs now, and they think they're going to come uh, from the top, but actually they're going to come down the main street this time. I think that's the fastest way to point. I think Union so, yeah. might overcommit. Now, it wouldn't hurt you on this map as much as it would on other maps if you were to wait for a different side of the map. Because um, this one you can quickly get over and help your friendlies out. Stairs, here comes uh, Racer stairs. leading the way with 19th Indiana. Looks like we've got a two-pronged attack here. Some of them are splitting off down the middle. Yep, there's the final push. It all comes 30. down to can Union hold this last charge. I think if Union holds here, they have a chance to win this. Yeah, I think if CSA can get them onto the last stand here, but I don't think they will. Uh, no, it's going to take at least one more charge. I think Union's safe in that, that aspect. And they were able to hold it. They are not last stand yet, so that is... Uh... That already might make it possible, though, for CSA to win. It has been going very good this round. They've been... Let me see who's on the yard. So it looks like it is Mr. Mattis was on the yardie. Boys, you know they're coming in the next 30 seconds. Careful. Get ready, they're coming around the corner, guys. Get ready. Here we go. The final push. And we have a reaction from the Union. I say the guys on the stairs need to get off the stairs now and get into a melee. Yeah. Ivy Blue and PD, they need to go in. There's the last stand. There's the last stand. 
This may come favor on. the uh, CSA now. It's going to be uh, really come down. If, uh, if they can plug this hole and then need them forward of point, I think they got it. How many? Oh, we got a big. All right, yeah, Union's got this. We got a big stream of reinforcements coming in from Maine. Yeah, the nice thing is when you hit that last stand in the middle of the charge, all those guys come back in. So it's. Yeah, it definitely favors the defender on this and this will be it. Union's going to counter charge up the street now. Exactly what they need to do. Keep them off the point. What do we got here? We got HD and 10th Tennessee along with some SR guys and some 20th New York. They're going for the flank. It's too late. That's it. HL 5 and 0. Oh. Boy, Wilkes has been tearing him up. I don't know what the damage to this token will be, though. But uh, any any final thoughts on a uh, an interesting downtown? Uh, yeah. Um, very quick match. Union did exactly what they needed to do, and that's just hold. Um, and they mutually supported very well. Um, they met the CSA no matter what the cost or wherever they came from. They, they met them and just blocked them. And that's exactly what you have to do. I think you're right. Mutual support, cooperation, that's the key. And um, if you got, and again, I want to thank uh, Colonel Lightburn for joining me. Um, you can find uh, his regiment uh, Discord link below, the 4th West Virginia. Still recruiting, still accepting new members. And that's. And I want to thank Mr. Kotal for allowing me to commentate these matches with him. Oh, anytime, man. I always like Mr. Lightburn on here. No, seriously, anytime, man. Oof. 1,400 versus 1,023. I think it's very good that uh, he shared casualties. That might have unit wiped him. Yeah. It's only going to give him about, what, 500? A little bit more than 500? Uh, so he fight, he plus, lives to fight another week. Yeah, he, he lives to fight another day. But um, anyway, that's it. Um, and I will see you all next week.